You ready to go back to Hogwarts? It's almost September 1st, which means it's almost time to go back to King's Cross Station and catch the train at platform nine and three quarters. And you need some accessories on the train because sometimes it rains, it gets cold. So we're going to pick from this one and it's a cowl, which I think is perfectly appropriate because it's the Hogwarts Express cowl. Now this is a stranded color work cowl and that's, it sounds exactly like what it is. It's the train going across a bridge and there's clouds. <laughs> so that's what we're going to make. I know because it's in a book and I don't want to mark up my book. I had the charts printed off so that way I can mark up my chart for the color work and not have to mark up my book. It uses um, worsted weight yarn in tweed colors. Now I'm not doing the yarn that they used, I'm, but I am using the colors. I'm going to be using these. Knit Picks Brava Tweed in the color Poinsettia and Elderberry. It's going to be so cute. So let's get ready to go back to school. I can't find my science five needles. US five, I can't find them. They are not in the interchangeable case. They are not hanging on the wall attached to a cord. Um, they weren't in my remnants bin. I didn't find them when I moved my yarn stash. I checked all of the projects that are currently, well, some of them I haven't worked on for a while, but I checked all the projects that are on needles. They're not using a size five. I have no idea where my needles are. So therefore I have to go buy more. Oh no. Um, I'm here at Hobby Lobby because my local yarn store is closed on Mondays. And it's Monday. I could go to the other one but I'd have to drive clear across town and I don't want to. Um, so Hobby Lobby because they carry Knitter's Pride and I could get size five tips for my needles for, no, for my cords. So we're gonna do that. I can't find my needles. And the cowl needs a size five needle to start. Hobby Lobby failed me. <laughs> they, yes, they had Knitter's Pride needles. Yes, they had circulars, but they didn't have any tips. Um, the only size five they had was 32 inches, and it's ones that have a long needle, and I don't like using long needles. I prefer short needles. <sighs> and I looked, and the store that's all the way across town is also closed on Mondays. Yeah. Well, I came to Hobby Lobby first because it's closer to my house. Um, so I guess I'll, I am now going to the store where I, well, the maker store where I occasionally teach. And I called and we have size vibes. So. <laughs> Oh, 
All right, I am sitting at the high school waiting for pickup. I brought the cowl with me so I can do a free rose. Um, we have a chance of thunderstorms this afternoon, and so the sky to the east is a... That's not east, that's west. West. Sky to the west is a beautiful slate blue, and that is my favorite weather ever. What's your favorite weather? Mine is the threatening of rain and actual rain and, you know, like foggy mountains, misty mountains. Honestly, it should just be Middle Earth. <laughs> anyway, so I am, again, sitting at the high school parking lot, knitting Harry Potter, and listening to Harry Potter. I am at towards the end of Goblet of Fire. The third task has started. Um, yeah, so... Let's continue with my knitting and wait for school to get out. Cowl update. We are this far. I'm losing stitches here. <laughs> okay. We're this far. All right, so I have the arches of the bridge and the track, the bridge part, <laughs> whatever, done. Um, all this puckering that you see here, that will block out. That's just the nature of stranded color work. My floats aren't too tight. They're looking pretty good here. So all that's left is the train and the smoke puffs. I know I said clouds earlier, but they're not clouds. They're smoke puffs. The, <laughs> the dog is drinking. <laughs> Sounds really funny when I say it that way. The smoke puffs are done in duplicate stitch. Um, and they are done in the blue. Now, there's a reason why I printed off or I had the charts copied. So that way I can do this. Ah! <laughs> All right, so I take my marker and I cross off every row as I do it um, but in the case of the 10 rows for the bridge part I just count and it's like oh I'm, I knew I'm gonna need to do 10 rows and so I just kept on going and then counted at the end so I got that because I would much rather mark up and throw away this paper than do mark up my book because first of all if you write a book you're rude um secondly i'm gonna want to keep this nice and hush yeah it's about halfway drop my marker about halfway done and i can most likely finish this today but I have other things I need to take care of, like getting ready for a mountain bike race this weekend. And it's going to be good. We're, we can get this done. Well, stitching part done. The blocking, maybe not so much. It's not quite as hot as it was in July for the Weasley sweater. So it, I can still block it outside, but I don't know. We'll see. Um, yeah. So let's go get something to watch and a snack and keep on with the train. All right. So I lied. I didn't get it done when I said I was going to because bike race prep took over and there was no way I was going to bring stranded color work to a bike race because it's dusty and it rained. So we're going to finish it today. Um, I helped my husband take the bike rack off the truck and my back protested and so now I'm slight. I tweaked my back a little bit. So I'm going to sit here with an ice pack, binge watch and finish it because I'm nearly done. Um, yeah. So, See? 
right it just looks like a bunch of squares and it doesn't look like anything so there's my progress um nearly done with the train part and yeah i have every confidence that we can get this done today so let's finish it Well, it's done. <laughs> um, it was fun to make. Let's take it off here. That's my doggy. Um, so, where are we at here? It, it flared out at the top because um, you go from stranded to single color and that just like loosened up the tension so much I, and so it even with blocking it's still a flare at the top I might do a mattress stitch and uh, seam it up a little bit on one side or two sides I don't know but it's a train with puffs of smoke, not clouds. Anyway, it's fun. This loose style of cowl is not my favorite. I prefer something a little more bulky and a little more tight. This, probably because it didn't end how it should. Like, as you can see, I'm It's not right but it turned out really well so aside from the top <laughs> being all wonky this this is really fun my husband can't couldn't see the train <laughs> when I was working on it he just saw shapes but the addition of the puffs of smoke at the top really helps him to see the train. Um, those were done in duplicate stitch and did not take very long. I do like the tweed. This tweed is one of my favorites. The bridge turned out nice. The train part turned out nice. It's just the top is wonky and I'm gonna have to fix that somehow. But I have every confidence that I can. Mm -hmm.